me and my boy Aga, big ones, about to head to PR. Yo, quickest I ever spent going through the airport. So we originally came around an hour, but we got through in like, how long? Two seconds. Like two seconds in and out. So now we just gotta wait. We actually didn't book together. The only reason why I'm really out here is because we got the tickets so cheap. So I paid like 27 for mine. And Aga, how much you paid? 55. So we just seen it and we was like, yo, we gotta be out. But we actually was listening up and they offered two seats for volunteers who want to be an emergency exit. Emergency exit means more leg room, more space. So yeah, I hate spirit, but there's opportunities there. We packing just with the book bag. So hopefully it'll be a safe flight and we get there in time, so. Just landed, we got here a little earlier than we thought. We was doing numbers, but in the island, try to see if we could get a Uber, see how we go. So to get to Puerto Rico, what you gotta do is do a COVID test between 72 hours and get results as negative. So we had to do that and that was brutal. But we got through, so heading out now. Just got the Renty. Um, got this joint for eleven dollars for the day. Uh, with insurance, it come out to about more or less twenty dollars a day. So me and my boy Aga about to be out and about in the city. I was OD shook. I thought I left my camera. I thought I lost this joint because I left it here. Let me see if y'all can see. I left that joint. Good thing it's locked. But can y'all see that? I left it right there. So first stop we got off is El Cuevos de los Indios. Um, it actually only cost us five dollars a piece to get in here. So hoping that we find something dope here. But we one of the only people's up here, so it's dope already. Yo, so we the only ones here, and look at this cave behind us, son. Yo, we gotta figure out how to get down there. You see that water down there? It's a little crazy, but we gotta figure out how to get down there. So, finally made it here. We're at La Cueva de los Indios. Um, this is said to have the most petroglyphs on this side of the coastal zone of Puerto Rico. So if you can see over here, it's kind of hard to see, but there's carvings that the Taino Indians, who were the natives here in Puerto Rico, left. So if you can look down over here, it's kind of tough to see, but I'm gonna try to get down here. There's no steps, but you know your boy got to do it. <laughs> I ended in the Careful, nigga. Coming, baby. <laughs> you did. That's crazy. 
Bu ne güzel. Yo. Yo, no lie, PR is hot. My boy, Aga lost the brush. <laughs> Nigga using a broom on his head. Yo, son got a broom on his head. <laughs> All right, so now we got La Cueva de Montana. Me and my boy, we gotta get these helmets because we're going through these caves now. So, let's see how it goes. specific meaning but because of the information I just told you they believe this could be a warning they call it guardians of the cave not guardians of the galaxy <laughs> Left eye cover up with these rocks. This is the nose. Here or here? Yeah, there, over there. Big one. Yeah. Oh, right you there. See? There, you actually focus, focus on the on icon on the, <laughs> All right. on the face. So it'll be like oh, that. There. Yeah. Ah. This joint right here really is single lane. Like, it's supposed to be two way, but I don't know how somebody gonna get through this. But this rain right here stopping us. So we're going slow. Yo, this is the life. We was trying to get some real dope footage here, but we've been out here for like three minutes. Y'all see how hard it's raining? I can't even see the area I want to be at. So because of that, we're just going to take an L. Sometimes on vacations, things don't go your way, but still having a dope ass trip though. early 7 a.m. Body get this day started. Um, hopefully it's gonna be a good day. So got a lot planned. So just trying to be able to get to everything. All right, so we just arrived in Gazalandi, I believe it's called. Shout out to my boy Cheyenne. He's the one that told me about this. So hoping it's gonna be dope. It was only $10 to get in here. So um, two and a half hours from San Juan, but hopefully it's gonna be dope views.
Gosvandolia, I think that's what it's called. Gosvandia. Gosvandia. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, this is a fire it's waterfall. Fire. Fire. But y'all gotta come out here. Just dropped the rental car off. Now we gotta wait 10 minutes. Everything went smooth with it. So, heading out, yo, Puerto Rico, it's been real. Yo, it's been real. Getting on the flight, heading back to Boston.